Hey guys, Anthony Euro with a review on Firefox 60, which was released on May 9th, 2018. Firefox 60 is a major browser release for ESR or the Extended Support Release Channel. Firefox ESR doesn't receive the same browser updates as the Rapid Release version. So we are currently here in the update release cycle. So if you're on a Firefox ESR, you would be upgrading from ESR version 52.8 to ESR 60. Existing ESR users don't need to necessarily update to ESR 60, at least not yet, because Firefox ESR 52.8 and 52.9 will be released alongside ESR 60 and 60.1. Now, ESR 60 will include a lot of the new Firefox Quantum features, and you will no longer have support for legacy add-ons. With this new version, IT professionals can now configure Firefox for their organizations either using group policy for Windows or a JSON file for Mac, Linux, or Windows OS. You can read more about Firefox Quantum for Enterprise from Ryan Pollock's blog post. You'll find the link in the description section. Firefox 60 ships with a web authentication API enabled by default thereby deploying two-factor authentication and providing an extra layer of security. This web authentication allows users to use security devices like the YubiKey to securely log into their online accounts. The new tab experience first introduced in Firefox Quantum has been enhanced. When you open a new tab, you'll notice a wider layout for top sites as well as a number of top sites icons. This is what the layout looked like in Firefox 59 and earlier versions. Firefox users in the US may now occasionally see sponsored stories within Pocket's recommendation section. Users have the option to disable this under New Tab's preferences. I'm not in the US, so I don't have the option, but this is what the disable option looks like. Mozilla says that it's part of their focus to deliver personalization without sacrificing user privacy and you can read more about it in this blog post. You'll find a link in the description section. The Cookies and Site Storage section under Preferences in the Privacy and Security section has been redesigned. Mozilla has consolidated the two sections into one called Cookies and Site Data. This is what it looked like in Firefox 15. Also, the Show Cookies button has been removed. Again, this is what it looked like in Firefox 59. And this is how it looks in Firefox 60. Quantum CSS, previously known as Stylo, which is the new CSS engine, makes its way to Firefox 60 in Android. Stylo was already released in the desktop version in Firefox 57. This is expected to significantly improve page rendering time. So there you have it, some of the key changes in Firefox 60. You can check the list of detailed changes in the release notes. You'll find the link in the description section. As always, I ran the BrowserMark benchmark test, and as you can see from the results, Firefox 60 and Google Chrome 66 were not too far apart in overall performance. Well, that's it for now. Until next time, thanks for watching.